Hi, this is Damon Tennan from www.mygedlive.com. We have just completed our very first live GED math class of the month of June. Of course, we've been doing these for a long time. Um, we did a special class in May, and now we have our new group of students starting with the month of June. Tonight, we talked about ratio and proportions, and we also talked about basic shape measurement. We talked about perimeter, area, and volume, and how those things interact on the GED test as a skill and also as word problem interpretation. Uh, just want to remind everybody that the test is changing in 2014. So this is the month of June and you feel like you have about six months left. Well, in reality, you really don't. Keep in mind, in the month of December, what's going to happen with public schools and public government offices all over the place? They're going to start closing down. So you really don't really have much of the month of December to get this test done. What's going to happen at the end of November? Thanksgiving, the schools are going to start closing down. What's going to happen in about a month, July and half of August, the schools are going to start closing down for the summer. So when you factor in those things, you really only have two or three months left to get this GED test done. I want to encourage you, visit us at our YouTube channel. Illinomad video, visit us at our website, www.mygedlive.com. Check us out. If you need help, with passing the GED math, take that step, get the help that you need, and pass it so you can get this GED test, pass this GED test, and get on with the rest of your life. Again, this is Damon Tennant from www.mygedlive.com. Thank you.